Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. And in this video, we are going to see that how we can create a menu in our website manually uh, without using any other uh, theme and something else. We are going to customize it completely by ourselves. So let's start the video and see how we can customize our menu and nav bar. So first of all, let's go to our dashboard. Okay, now uh, we are on our dashboard. So first of all, I'm going to open my website uh, to see that how currently it's appearing. So currently it appears something like this, which have contact us page in starting and then home and then sample page. But uh, what I want uh, to have over here in this place, I don't want to show this line. And then I want home page, contact us page, about us page and uh, one other page. Okay, so uh, let's see that how we, we can do this thing. So first of all, go to your dashboard and go to pages section. Okay, now you can see that here we have four pages. So for now, I'm going to delete uh, these two pages which are not useful right now. So just delete them. Okay, now we need one more page that is about us and the other is shop page. Okay, so let's create these pages. So, about us is the title of our page and from here you can just publish your page. We have multiple options in a page uh, over here like template of our page, permalink. You can edit your permalink too and you featured image of your page discussion uh, in discussion we have allow comments option that we won't comment on our page or not and then we have parent page option as well but currently we are not going with these options uh, we are just going to publish our page and then we will see other options that how a page works in wordpress so for right now go and publish this page just click on publish okay now our page is live if you just go on this link you will be able to see our page okay here you can see that uh, we have our about us page okay now uh, we wanna add one more page that is show page from here you can directly add a new page or you can just go back and click on add new so i'm going to create a new page with a title of show okay now we have done our page we have done with our show page okay so here is our show page you can see that the uh, link is directly added over here so we want to rearrange these urls properly so for that go back to our dashboard and go to appearance section okay here we have our uh, appearance section go to customize also menus are used to edit our menu section but uh, right now we want to add some other things so we are going over here you see that i clicked on site identity okay uh, from here you can select a logo for your website and here you need to put your site title like this and here is our tagline so right now i don't want any tagline or if you want this tagline you can just remove from over, remove and if you don't want this thing then you can just remove it okay so right now i don't want any tagline so i removed it when i put logo then i will put my tagline as well okay uh so now if you see we have one another option that is site icon the site icon will appear over here the site icon is also known as fav icon so fav icon is shown in your title of your page so right now we don't want to add any logo and site icon so here we have done with our this portion so just publish it okay our content is published right now and from here if you see little bit down you will be able to see a menu option just click on click on that here we have one menu and this page is invalid so just if you see any uh, page which appears in red color then you can just remove it because this page doesn't exist first of all we want to oh, rearrange these things so i just put home page on the top 
then show page and then about us page and the last we have our contact us page okay so we have done with this thing as well and if you want to add any other item then just click on this add item if any other page which doesn't appear over here then click on add item and select out of these pages your all pages will appear over here okay now one more thing i want to show you that here if you see that we have our shop page again if i want to show a drop down with a contact us page then i just need to drag it in the uh, right side side if we drag this we will be able to get a drop down section okay so if i want a drop down in a drop down uh, you can say nested drop down so i just need to drag it in the left side okay so if i just go on contact us section and hover then you can see that we have our uh, contact us space and then shop and then about us space okay so this is how you can create drop downs and uh, if you want to remove these things then click on this thing and remove click over here again and remove okay we are now ready to go but uh, if you want to add any post in the same page so in the same header then you can just click on the post section and then add this thing Okay. now our post is added over here if you want to add any category and any tag in your header section then you can do the same process okay so if i just go over here you can see that i have a video section as well right now i don't want my post over here i just uh, i only want to show you that how you can do this thing okay and from here you can manage your menu location that uh, in which menu you want to show these pages so i wanted this in um, desktop horizontal menu and mobile menu okay so if you want to show that how it will appear in our tablet and other devices so you can click over these options and you will be able to see it so if i click here then you can see that how it appears similarly it appears in our mobile devices okay so go back right now and please don't forget to publish the changes okay here we have done with our menus go and refresh the site page now you can see that we have our home page then we have our shop page then we have about us page and contact us page now the thing is that if i go to my website then which page will appear first uh, for now if you see our home page should be appear over here but our video post is showing here to remove this thing what you can do go back and go to settings option go to reading option so when you go on a uh, reading page so here you can see we have some options to choose a page for our home page so here is our home page displays the first thing is your latest post and a static page so click on a static page and choose your page you wanna show in the show first to your visitors so i want to show my home page okay so, and from here you can also select your post so right now i don't want to show any post page okay now you can see that uh, if if i save the changes and go over here then you will be able to see our home page instead of the video post and uh, uh, before going to the browser we are going to see these options too so uh, here is a blog pages show at most option so by increasing and decreasing we can increase or decrease the number of blog shown in a page okay so right now same changes and refresh the web page if you see uh, our home page is now visible in case of our default url so this is how you can edit your menus in your wordpress site without using any other template or any other theme in our upcoming videos we are going to customize this local website completely uh, uh, so uh, for today's video we have done with our menus topic in the next video we will see another topic so till now bye and thank you for watching this video thank you for watching this